It is our great pleasure to introduce Bukong's biological filtering technology. BBF, the technology of selectively removing organic matters and nutrients, is conveniently used for not only new sewage treatment plants, but also retrofitting former facilities. It is the most advanced biological wastewater treatment technology that provides the highest discharge quality for total maximum daily loads, combined sewage overflows, and reusing effluent. BBF combines biological treatment technology with physical filtration technology by using media. Because of the highly concentrated and activated microorganisms on the media surface, the BBF shows higher technical efficiency. The BBF uses two separate media layers that allow for space optimization. A secondary sedimentation tank is usually not required. The BBF consists of an influent distribution system, air supply system, fixed media layer, floating media layer, and strainer blocks with special nozzles. The influent distribution system consists of the influent waterway, wire, and pipe. Combined, these parts ensure that wastewater is evenly distributed to each BBF reactor. The air supply system is used for biological treatment and backwashing. During the biological treatment, the supplied air keeps the floating media layer in aerobic condition. During backwashing, the air easily removes suspended solids and sludge from media layer. The fixed media layer is located at the bottom of the reactor. Most of the larger size particles are pre-filtered through this fixed media layer. The media that is used in the fixed media layer is bigger and heavier compared to the floating media. Due to the primary treatment by the fixed media, the floating media will easily meet the equivalent suspended solid load and it requires a minimum backwashing period. Additionally, flocculants can be added for phosphorus removal. The floating media layer is located at the center of the reactor. Organic compounds and fine suspended solids are treated with this floating media layer. Furthermore, the removal of nitrogen, either through nitrification or denitrification, can be selected based on the characteristics of the project. The location of the air supply provides various treatment conditions of the floating media layer, aerobic condition, anoxic condition, and both aerobic and anoxic condition. The strainer blocks play the role of preventing the loss of floating media and ensure even discharge. After the wastewater in the influent waterway distributes to each reactor evenly through the influent wire, it floats to the surface of each BBF reactor through the influent distribution system. The influent wastewater flows from the bottom to the top layer and most of the contaminants are removed efficiently. Through the nozzles of the strainer blocks, treated water is collected at the storage tank in the upper part of the reactor. It discharges to the treatment waterway. During operation, suspended solids and increased biomass will accumulate at the media layers, causing head loss of the BBF reactor. This head loss can be recovered by periodical backwashing. Head loss creates changes of pressure and water level. These changes will be detected by various sensors, and the backwashing process will be initiated automatically. There are three modes for backwashing, simplified backwashing, regular backwashing, and extra backwashing. The simplified backwashing removes suspended solids in the fixed media layer. Treated water is used for backwashing and flows downstream by gravity. The leftover water from backwashing is drained to the sludge treatment process. Without enough head loss recovery, basic backwashing is applied to the floating media layer. The treated water is applied in the same way as the simplified backwashing. Water and air are used respectively to remove excessive sludge and attach solid from the media layers. The extra backwashing is used if the head loss recovery is not accomplished by the regular backwashing. The extra backwashing uses water and air simultaneously. 
The head loss recovery efficiency is much higher than simple and basic backwashing. The BBF technology is applied to many sewage treatment plants in Korea and China. Gwangju is the first Korean city that enforced TMDL, total maximum daily loads. The BBF was implemented to three plants in Gwangju. The surrounding area's development was initiated with the BBF process, which caused the effluent's BOD level being less than 5 mg per liter and the TN level being less than 10 mg per liter. Yangju City tried to design an environmentally friendly new town. It is a very symbolic and challenging case for Yangju to make an artificial stream by reusing the wastewater treatment facility's effluent by applying BBF technology. Modulated technology of BBF has a simple structure. Therefore, a minimized size and optimized layout will be provided. Thus, BBF can be actively applied for the modernization of sewage treatment plants. The Zhengrang Sewage Treatment Plant, which treats 1.71 million cubic meters per day, is one of the largest sewage treatment plants in Asia. The BBF process has been applied to the modernization and retrofitting project of the facility, including the discharge of stormwater, which proves its superior technology. Additionally, the BBF process was selected as one of the top eight sewage treatment technologies by China's National Development Planning Commission and applied to the Khufu Sewage Treatment Plan in China. This is the first case in which Korea's sewage treatment technology of reusing effluents was exported to China. BBF is also the best method for combined sewer overflows. Due to the higher concentration of suspended solids and organic matters, CSOs can cause problems to wastewater treatment operation and discharge. The city of Seoul has plans to install BBF at the Jungrang and Sunan wastewater treatment plant to protect contamination of the Han River from problems caused by CSOs. It is possible for BBF to be implemented for nitrification, denitrification, and organic matter removal according to the water quality situation. It is also used to not only retrofit sewage treatment plants, but also advance the treatment of livestock wastewater, industrial wastewater, and the concentration water of RO systems. In fact, it has been operated in over 10 public livestock wastewater treatment plants in Korea. The BBF process will offer the most suitable solutions for the various needs of customers, such as the new establishment of wastewater treatment plants, facility expansions, improvements and renovations, and the reuse of the treated water. Because of the efficiency of the BBF process, the facility will be able to maximize the use of its site and raise the city's competitive edge. BBF Technology presents an integrated model of high efficiency and the most advanced wastewater treatment process. It will change the general concept of wastewater treatment into being able to reuse and produce. Bukong's Biological Filtering Technology